My name is David Brock. I'm the Senior Research Fellow here at the Chemical Heritage Foundation, I'm joining you from CHF's museum. A very important and fascinating um, aspect of the history of instrumentation is captured by this instrument right here. This is a um, infrared gas analyzer called the MEXA, made by Horiba Limited in Kyoto, Japan, starting in the 1960s. This particular instrument measures uh, carbon monoxide, specifically carbon monoxide found in automobile exhaust. Um, the connection between instrumentation, the environment, and regulations um, to protect the environment uh, is very strong and long-lasting. Um, in a very real sense, if you can't measure something, you can't regulate it. And uh, the Horiba Mexa analyzer very much captures that um, connection. Um, this device was um, developed actually from a medical gas analyzer to measure uh, the breath of patients to, to judge what was happening with them during um, medical procedures, um, adapted to measure carbon monoxide and then essentially ruggedized to be used um, on the in a garage floor with a sensor stuck in a tailpipe to, to um, gauge the performance of an engine and how much of this pollutant it was putting out. Similar devices were, met, were later developed for automobile exhaust gases and this proved to be a um, major element in um, protecting air quality, um, combating smog, and, um, and other environmental concerns. Um, so, in fact, um, the certification of instruments by the um, Environmental Protection Agency for measuring these sorts of uh, environmental concerns became a, a very important issue for instrument instrument builders, instrument makers, and um, Hariba's MEXA analyzer was uh, in fact approved by the EPA for the measurement of carbon monoxide in automobile exhaust. If you'd like to learn more about this instrument or uh, the connection between instrumentation and the environment, um, please visit CHF's museum or visit us online at chemheritage.org. I'm David Brock, thank you very much.